Hello everybody, my name is Mike Kinnick and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 The Great War as we are continuing on as the Art... Uh, yes, again, as the Artaman Empire. Uh, so I have taken a few liberties here. The first one is I have taken a couple months just to kind of close things up over here. Um, there was really nothing going on. Uh, it was just grindy, grindy, grindy all through Africa, which... I have tried to reduce as much as possible, but it looks like we're going to have some serious troubles um, getting through Central Africa. Up here, fine. Yeah, you can see we took a bunch of ports. We took all these ports, and they're not really having a good time. But most importantly, most importantly is Enver's Dream, the end game of our game, is about to happen. We are about to embark on uh, Enver's Dream, which basically is retaking the Turkic lands that uh, weren't necessarily lost, but we migrated out of several hundred years before. And we're going to go ahead and take them back. As a matter of fact, um, I should probably get busy on uh, justifying war goals on all of our future victims. Oh, I, I don't want to say victims, but y you know what I mean. Uh, we are about to be done uh, justifying against Persia, which is 115 out of 160 days. That's pretty good. Uh, at least I'm happy with that. And in the meantime, I mean, look at what we've done. We've reduced. It, it's just a matter of time now and a matter of attrition. But here's the big problem is that all of this, we are doing all of the heavy lifting here in Central Africa. And as a result, look at this. Our armored cars are down. Our horse-drawn vehicles are even further down. Oh my god, early artillery too is down. Everything is down. And uh, you know what? There's really not a lot we can do about that right now. But we can continue to just fight back. Because uh, look at this. They're going to go ahead and attack us, and it's going to fail, and after which we will counterattack and win. I, at least I think we're going to win. I hope we're going to win. Look at you, you stupid goddamn Japanese. I don't even know how you got over here to begin with. Just... Alright, ready? And boom. Yeah, now we're counterattacking. And there's not a lot you can do about that, my friend. Alright. Now, you come down here... And let's go ahead and start working on these guys. There is one more port to take here. Where is that? Yeah, it's in Mozambique. But, man, we have got to do something about that. Because none of this is really working out. And, and guys, look, I do want to apologize for losing my temper and having a little tiny hissy fit pretty much the entirety of last episode. That is not my way, and I will do better. I promise. Okay, now with the awkward part out of the way, let's get back to doing what we're doing. Um, back up here, we are about to win in Ajaccio and take out the Free French capital, which I don't know if that will do anything at all. But in any case, let's go ahead and check out our training divisions here. Well, nothing good there, but um, what did happen while well, you guys were asleep and you didn't see any of this was that uh, we lost a naval battle. And you can probably tell <laughs> yet again that our guys got hosed. We did lose our heavy cruiser uh, and we did lose our battleship. I'm sorry to report. But the rest of our ships, guys, the rest of our ships are, are are fine. They're fine. It's good. It's really good. See, we're about to we're about to have more. So I am not actually too upset about that. Um. Oh. <gasps> no, I was wrong. We didn't lose the ISS Mictanic, guys. Look, guys. Look, it's the Mictanic. Boom. Get into the training. Yeah, you train yourself up so good. This is going to be great. All right, so let's put these two subs back into the sub fleet. And they are going to be doing good very soon. Yes! Oh, I'm so happy we got the ISS Mike Tannic finally. 
Finally, guys. Ugh, you know how bad it was going. Hang on. As a matter of fact, maybe you shouldn't be out there patrolling. No, you shouldn't be doing any of that. Yeah, neither of you. Just go to sleep. Go to sleep. We'll let the British have their little slice of heaven there in, in the Western Mediterranean because fuck them. We already won. All right, what's going on here? What is going on here? I, I don't... Okay, I know we're counterattacking there, but... My God, man. No, you should all be attacking here. I don't know what I was thinking. There we go. And you stop that attack, please. Or, or don't. Get, okay, you know what? That's on you. That's on you. See you later, buddy. Man. Okay, so how are we looking here? We are going to bowl over the Persian infantry divisions because look at them. Look at that. They got four helmets and one shovel. Nowhere near as good as ours. We got artillery. We got... What do we got? We got logistics companies. We got guild hospitals. They are not going to touch us. We're going to bowl right over them. And I almost feel bad, guys. Like, I really do. Like, I almost feel bad for everything that's about to happen to them. But in any case, here, let's... Guys, can we please win this already? What is going on here? Seriously. No, all of you. All of you attack. There we go. Oh, let's see. Wow, they're getting an encirclement penalty, which I'm not sure how, because I did not take those uh, two provinces behind them, but I'm happy about this. We can we can live. That's fine. All right, so how do I... Oh, the Germans did get this for a second. Why? I don't know. Anyway, engineer company. It is now time to... Take our technology up a level. It is May 1917, so it is not a good idea for us to get any of these. Or any of these, as a matter of fact. Yeah, we're not going to do that. Um, I would... Uh, we already did the logistics company. Okay, so let's see what we can do in industry. Um, I mean, no, that's four years ahead of time, so we're not going to do that. Not even close. Uh, radio. Yes, improved radio. Thank you. Finally. Dear God. Okay, so what do we... Oh, wow. We have lots. Lots of insurrection, but, you know, we kind of expected that. That's what happens when you take a lot of territory. Um, and I'm okay with that. For now. As soon as we get all of this wrapped up, like all of South Central... Africa wrapped up, we will actually put most of these divisions to um, to uh, pacifying these locations, because holy crap. Yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot. Oh my. As a matter of fact, maybe... You know what? If we're just eating attrition anyway... Yeah, we are. We're just eating attrition, and these guys are standing around doing nothing. Absolutely nothing. You bastards. Alright. So what's going on here? Yeah, some of them are going in. What about over here? I feel like we have a lot of divisions standing around. Anybody who's standing around for supply issues is probably going to get put into this new army. And what are you doing? Yeah, okay. You guys are good. You're safe. You! And you. And I, I... I guess one of you. Okay, you are going into a new army. And you are going to be... The West African... Occupation Force. Oh, that's totally how you spell this. That's how you spell all of this. Okay. Good. Uh, do you need a general? No, but I will give you Halil Kub Pasha. All right. Okay, so let's see. Where are we? Okay, Nedj. Okay, here, obviously. There, there, there. Oh, everywhere. Why don't you just say so that we're meeting resistance everywhere? 
God. Okay. Well, look. Here's what we're gonna do. Where, where's that first place? Okay. We're gonna do this. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and garrison there. And where else? Where else was there? Oh, this... Oh, boy. These guys are going to be spread around so far. Oh, boy. Wait, there? Is it there? No, it's not there. Is it there? Yeah, I think it's there. Nedged? Yeah, nedged. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we got to do nedged. And where else? Um. Yep, there, too. All right, let's see how you guys do. You guys figure it out. I'm done babysitting. What? What is this? What's going on here? <gasps> Ooh, oh no, no. Okay, you guys handle that. Please handle that. How are you losing against the Japanese? They had to, like, they had to float forever to get here. Jesus Christ. Ugh. All right, next. Wait, did, wait a minute. Did those guys actually go... Okay, they're going. Alright, good. Alright, well, what did you expect? You guys are being stupid bastards. You're doing nothing to further the war effort. What are we doing here? Can we attack and win? No, we cannot. Not even close. Not even close. So what do we do, guys? What do we do? Huh. Alright, so let's go like this. Look, I only see one division right here, so the more we divide them up, the better. How is that attack going? Okay, not good, but you're gonna get you're gonna get help. Just relax. Just relax, my friend. Ooh, ooh. Oh okay, so we are making somewhat of a breakthrough here. That's good. All right, that's good. Uh, here's what I'm really worried about, though. Is, are these guys ready? We should be ready to invade uh, Persia at any given time. Okay, maybe not any given time. A few more days. A few more days. All right, and where should you go? You are a port defense unit, after all. Port Sudan, no. No, no, no that makes sense. All right, Mogadishu. Yeah, you should definitely go to Mogadishu and get on the rails to get there, please. And we do have our very first Marine Division ready. I forgot to mention that, but they are still training up. Still training up, and do we need them still? Not really. I mean, man, you're doing such a good job. You're all doing a great job. All of you doing such great jobs. Ugh. All right, next. Who? Oh, this is a mess. This is all a goddamn mess. Here. You go through. You keep pushing. And... Okay, some of you are attacking up that way. And that's fine. But where we really need you is dead center. Everything else will take care of themselves. There you go. Actually, one of you should probably... Um, I was wrong. I was wrong. There we go. Any more problems here? No. No, it doesn't look like. Uh, we have effectively cut them all off from each other. And, of course, Germany's no help whatsoever. So we're all just going to sit here and stare at each other, apparently. No, because that is not here. We were all going to attack them, weren't we? At least cut them in half? You dicks. Hurry up. God. Oh, jeez, Paradox. Please fix this. I, I, I mean, I've been trying. I've been trying really hard to do good on this mod, but now I am at the point where I am at mental exhaustion because I don't have the time to deal with just this little bit. That's how bad off I am mentally, as I can't even deal with that little bit of Belgium, this little bit of the UK. Like, none of it's working. Like, what? 
What are we doing here? We are all eating attrition. I mean, look at this. I can only imagine what our production looks like. Holy shit. We are about to have our very first tank division, though. So that's... That's fun. You fucking... Alright, fine. How is this going? Large Navy. Alright, so we get 20% research bonus for fleet and being doctrine. Okay, good. Technology sharing. What do we get from that? Yes. 50% research for electronics, infantry weapons, and support artillery, and plus 15% bonus for industry. So, yes, please. Oh, can we please beat these guys now? I just want your stuff. Give me your goodies. I just want your goodies. Oh, boy. Okay, yeah, that's going to take a while. That's certainly going to take a while. All right, it looks like our resistance has gone down some. We're still waiting on some units to arrive. Like up there, over there, over there, over there, and there, and there, and there, and there. You fucking... Whatever, guys. Whatever. I don't care. Just take what you need. Take what you need. You are Ottoman now. I don't understand what the big problem is. All right, when are you going to get there? Three days. For fuck's sake, man. Hurry up. Hurry up. Oh, God, guys. You see, I was trying. I really was. Where are you going? And why are you going? No, let's let's wrap these guys up. Come on, this is good. This is... This is... This is all... This is how all this works. All right. And then from there, you move on to attack that. And you do the same. I assume they will arrive around the same time. Or will they? Yeah. Yeah, they're beating the piss out of that Italian infantry division. They have nothing. They got nothing to stop us. And of course, we again are the only ones doing any fighting here whatsoever you guys are not gonna win i know we're eating a river penalty here but god damn it come on guys and how is this going oh we're finally up to 92 percent probability to win and they're in but how are we looking here on their organization it's not good they are not gonna beat us i mean look at that and we still have two heavy artillery regiments in reserve. Like, we haven't even started to bring out our big guns yet. So, yeah, you guys are about to go away, I think. And I don't have any delusions that that will actually change uh, the war situation. It's, it would just make me feel better to get them done and out of here. <sighs> Fuck's sake, man. All right, Ember Stream, how we doing? How we looking, guys? Seven more days. We got one more week to start Ember Stream. I am so thrilled about that. You have no idea. All right, and we are finally pushing them back. Kinda. Kinda, guys. I mean, this is... Ugh. Ooh, it's messy. Ooh, it's messy. Nobody wanted to occupy Africa. That... that that was a mistake of the First World War. Is nobody thought that we'd actually have to fight for this. Or at least in this iteration of the First World War. And you're about to die, so that's good. And what are we doing here? What are we doing here? Oh, jeez. Okay, the Portuguese are going to lose. It's, it's going to take a minute here, but... What are you doing? Okay. Yeah, it's only a matter of time for them. And then we take that port, and then what port is left? They have this port. But that is nowhere near, nowhere near enough supplies to supply all these guys. Like, I know that we're hurting right now. I mean, my God, we're hurting. But imagine what they're doing. Like, with, they have no ports. They got nothing. Well, up here they do, but... I mean, dear God, what what is this? All right. 
Yeah, we're not actually in on any of those attacks, so that is fine. I'm okay with that. Now, do we have our air power in place? Yes, we do, for the beginning of Oliver's dream. And there it is. Okay, we're happy, we're happy. What is going on here? Will you guys please wrap them up? You're giving them false hope. And the same thing's kind of happening here. They're they're about dead. Yeah, they got nothing. They got nothing. They got nothing. Okay, justification for conquering Tehran for Ottoman Empire is finished. Guess what? Operation Onverse Dream commence. Potential enemies. Oh, good. Good. Try me. Try me. There we go. Alia. Get busy. Move. Free France is called Persia is our enemy in the German French War. Well, Persia joined the Entente. Well, we'll see how far that gets you, friends. Friendzo. Here we go. Oh, yeah. You're going to get worn down. You have no artillery. What were you thinking? What were you thinking? Okay, we got some spectators here, so we're going to get them moving. And we're going to get you moving. As a matter of fact, that's... That's the problem. One stream needs to be put on aggressive. There we go. There we go. We're pushing them back left, right, center. And what is this? Yeah, redo that attack. There we go. You see, guys, everything's fine. Everything's fine. These guys are being pinned down. We're going to push these guys back. Yeah, as a matter of fact, you after that, you go and get to Reese. Hell yeah, you do. And you cut those divisions off. So here we are, guys. World War I is old news. It's just really old news. And as a matter of fact, we're... Why? Why are we even involved anymore? We're just here to save face. That's all we're doing. There's nothing good about this front of the war anymore. We are all about Onver's dream. So, here we go. And we're moving. Yes, we are. As a matter of fact, you get you lock them up. Thank you. And you're still going to win. One on two. Love it. Okay. Yeah, see, here we go. These guys just got nothing. You got nothing. You don't have the first thing to defend against the might of the Ottoman Empire. Just go with it, guys. All you had to do is come with us like we went. Okay, yeah, we were we were hostile. We were going to get you, but still. Mad Mad questions the motives of Afghanistan. And yes, I will be with you shortly, Herat. Just wait. You just wait. And see, here we are. We're going to cut these guys off. No, you go up there. And then you go up there. So we're going to cut off those three divisions, and uh, this division is going to get on to Tabriz, I believe, no, and you need to get on further than Tabriz. Let's not, let's not make this complicated, guys, please. You guys have already, how? How did I already get cut off? You fuck. No. No. And no. There. Can we please reset this? So stupid. How did that even happen? All right, we got one more. Ooh, we're about to have a heavy tank division. All right, so I'm gonna put, um, yeah, I'm gonna put that factory in the heavy tanks because I can. And what do we, that's fine. Yeah, we're still missing close air support, but guys, look, it's fine. It's fine, look, we're, we're just killing all of them. There we go. There we go. It's almost all green. I'm happy with that. As a matter of fact, you get this province and then you attack there. Let these guys handle it. They'll be fine. We are so much better equipped than they are, it's not even funny. Okay, so we uncut off our division. Now we're having trouble taking a vase, but let's let's do this. Let's do this here. Let's do that. So much better. 
And then you keep going. Cut these fucks off. Or can we? Oh yeah, we can. No big deal. No big deal. Just watching you guys. Look, guys! It's a tank! In our first tank division. Our very first heavy tank brigade. You know what? I, I am not going to wait for them to train up. They have to get to this front immediately. Just get here. Just get here. I cannot wait to put them into, um, into effect. Guys, it's going to be great. Hello? Can I please get... There we go. Now they're on the rails. What do we got? Okay, we have two military factories, so let's put one in horse-drawn vehicles and one in support equipment. And yes, I know we're short on supplies. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, we are taking up Persian territory left and right, and they are not stopping us. Or at least, yeah. No, they're not stopping us at all. Where are you going? You get. Get up here. Come on. We're a moving. Follow them. Guys, guys, Onver's dream is happening. I am so thrilled. And, I mean, not only is it happening, but we're about to get our very first, very first heavy tank brigade, possibly the first heavy tank brigade in existence into the fight. Because I didn't see the Germans. I've never seen a German heavy tank division. I've never seen Austro-Hungarian tanks. I've never seen anyone else but us have tanks. So, yeah, the way I see it, we, we kind of won World War One. as a matter of fact. Oh, speaking of heavy tanks, early heavy tank two. Boom, done. Now we can start upgrading. Anyway, naval. Naval, I want to start the Dreadnought 4. I desperately want to start the Dreadnought 4, just so you guys know. Okay, outdated equipment in production. Yeah, the early Heavy Tank Mark 1, which we did a bunch of upgrades to. And we might be able to do the same thing here. Because, oh, yeah. Let's give it some more armor. And some more reliability. And a bigger gun. You know I like gun. Let's give it engine and gun. Okay. Early heavy tank two. No. No. Early heavy tank two. Mark one. That's the one. That's the ticket. You see, guys, we are going to be fine. You doubted me. I know you doubted me. I would have doubted me too all throughout this campaign. Even back as early as the Balkan War. You guys who were desperately giving me advice. I, I mean, I I know that you were giving me good advice. It's just that you didn't think I could actually do it. Hmm. Anyway, uh, let's go on here. Where is our heavy tank division? I want to get them up on the front line before anything else happens. Uh, and we end this episode. Because, yes, we do have to end the episode, guys. It's been running on a little bit long. But we are going to plow over the Persians and every enemy after this. Because of the awesomeness of one, Operation Onverse Dream, and two, because, I mean, we got, we got tanks now. We got tanks. And they really can't do much about it. So let's go ahead and assign these factories, free military factories. We got one more. Um, let's go ahead and put that back in artillery. We need that desperately. So, guys, thank you for sticking with me through the thick and thin of this campaign with my moodiness and crybabiness. But if you enjoyed this, there is plenty more on the way, so please consider subscribing. I will see you next time on the battlefield. Bye-bye.